Hi there, my name is Kevin Deluzio and I'm the Dean of the Faculty of Engineering and Applied Science here at Queen's University. Today I want to talk to you about the incredible world of engineering. And what is an engineer? Well, engineers use science to design solutions to real world problems to make our lives better. It's as simple as that and it's as broad as that as well. To engineers, problems are the motivator. And here at Queen's Engineering we teach engineers how to solve those problems in a particular way using design thinking. So that means coming up with a real precise and well-defined problem statement. It means brainstorming for solutions. It means testing those solutions against known laws of physics and the uh, expectations of the solution to that problem. And it means testing those solutions and iterating those solutions continuously until we get at the one that satisfies the design requirements and solves the problems to, the exp to our expectations. And if you think of engineering that broad, well, there's hardly an area of life or society where engineers aren't involved in. And well, let's take this phone as a simple example. You know, the material science and materials engineering that goes into designing a touchscreen surface that responds to my fingers, but still is tough enough to withstand daily use. The batteries that power these devices, the fact that the materials for those are rare earth metals that need to be extracted from our environment. And the engineers that design that have to do it in a way that it is safe to the people that work in that area and also safe to our environment. The powerful electronics that allow me to hold a computer in my hand have to be designed and are implemented by engineers. Similarly with the fact that this can respond to my voice and recognize me. Siri knows who I am and that artificial intelligence is designed by engineers in a way that satisfies and responds to the user needs. In so many other areas of society we see engineers working to design solutions for everyday life. Take biomedical engineering, which is looking at how can we uh, improve our function and design devices that aid things like mobility or the way our heart functions or to improve human health. Those technological solutions are developed by biomedical engineers. Our world around us and the structures that we live in uh, need to be done so, so again, they're environmentally friendly in the fact that you, they're using sustainable energy sources, but they're strong and can withstand the forces of nature on these structures. In nearly all aspects of society, we have engineers working to design solutions to produce a better world. 